casting directors are going to decide whether or not to bring you in for a role based upon your headshot. Why your wardrobe choices matter. Coming up next. I'm Cody Dorkin, owner of Studio 24, one of the largest TV and film acting studios in California. I worked in LA as an actor for over 15 years, working on over 100 TV shows and movies. At Studio 24, we help aspiring actors gain the knowledge, the tools, and the skill they need to make acting their career. Get ready. We're turning your dreams into reality right now. So actors know that they need headshots, but they're not super intentional all the time about what they're going to do when they get there. They bring all of their wardrobe and they let the photographer choose what they're going to do, but it's not the right way. You're spending all this money on headshots, you wanna make it count, and that means that you wanna be intentional and have purpose behind the wardrobe that you're bringing. If you have a talent agency, certainly reach out to them and ask them. But you should already have an idea of your brand as an actor and how you're going to dress appropriately to make those certain looks or those headshots work for you in the best way possible. Really what that means is you have to understand what your brand is first and then you will be dressing character specific. Now right now I am specifically talking about theatrical work, so for television and film, and the types of characters that would go into that. If you fit a certain look or a certain type, you are gonna wanna make sure that your wardrobe is fitted for the look that you are doing. This is why when you're looking for headshot photographers, your photo shoot is broken down into one look, two looks, three looks, four looks, because that is in reference to the specific character types that you want to capture on camera, and your wardrobe should be specific to those character types. You should pre-plan this way ahead of time and have an idea of what that is well before you show up for your shoot. That way, you won't have to shoot again. You want to stay away from really light or really dark colors. You want to find things that are in your complexion kind of palette, but uh, earth tones look great. Stay away from pastels, stay away from any type of wardrobe that has like logos or anything that you could read. Um, also tight patterns do not read well on camera, so you really want to stick to some, some solid colors. In addition to that, layers look really great. I would always try to layer up an outfit. It gives it a little bit more depth and dimension and is much more visually interesting. Before you show up at your next shoot with your entire wardrobe, make sure you spend some time ahead of time pre-planning the wardrobe that fits your character type so you have a very clear idea of what you're going to be wearing for your specific looks at your shoot. So for more tips on wardrobe or just headshots in general, or anything that has to do with your acting career, go to studio24.com and go to our blog. We'll see you there.